So as you know, my name is Keontae Ashe, and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a reading for all of our divine feminines, okay? So DF, Empress, High Priestess, Energy only. If you in any way at all identify as a divine masculine, you can go ahead, sir, and get out. Because this reading right now is not for you, all right? This reading right now is not for you, sir, all right? So let us go ahead, y'all. Welcome, welcome to anybody who is new and welcome back to anybody who is returning. It is always, always, always an honor, a pleasure, and most definitely a good time. So somebody's masculine is coming through, all right, really, really wanting to say something. I actually had them wait, okay? I had them wait because I wanted to spend some time with my family real quick. You know, I was like, wait, you, you're just going to have to pause for a second, all right? Because see here, somebody thinks that you believe they're lying now for the seven of swords to be what i see here listen i don't know if they are or not but let me tell you something that card ain't gonna show up for no reason all right so this could be the person strategizing though as well all right maybe they're not telling you everything all right putting a plan together and because they're not telling you everything you think they're lying or something like that all right it could be why they want to come through so bad and say something but let us see yeah we have the knight of swords i don't know man i feel like this person didn't tell you the truth or I don't know, man. It's not looking good for this masculine. Let us see. We have the page of wands in reverse. Mm. Okay. Well, this masculine is in a rush to prove himself, in a rush to do something, in a rush to fix it, but they're still not being honest with you. This is not going to get anything going. This is not going to excite you. This is not going to, all right? I feel like there's something that this person, once again, you know what I mean? Seven of Swords, deception. They deceived you in some way. They lied to you about something. You found out about it. You confronted them about it or you pointed it out. Whatever it is, you, how do I put it? You confronted it head on, okay? If I did not already say that, because I'm channeling sometimes I feel like, you know, it's all over the place. But with the Knight of Swords here in reverse, once again, they did not tell you the truth. They were not honest about something. Ace of Cups in reverse. So a secret came out, the moon in reverse. A situation with someone from their past, I feel like, is not 1,000% over and it, like, needs to be. We have the Ten of Cups here, okay? This could be an ex who, like, comes back or something. You get what I'm saying? Hmm. And you're like, what the? Yeah, Eight of Wands <laughs> first. Okay. Um, hmm. Making the person, how do I put this? Giving them the freedom to make the decision that they want to make. Yeah, Seven of Cups in reverse. There's no confusion. You're just not in for competing. Okay? Divine feminists don't do that. Ace of Cups in reverse. You're like, even if that's my masculine, you know, that's what's up. I'm not being lied to. I'm not doing none of that. If I have to just let it burn, let it burn, honey. You get what I'm saying? You like, let that damn thing burn. But what I will not be doing is being lied to, played with, any of that. Like, not doing it. Yeah, we got the King of Cups in reverse, Four of Pentacles. You feel like somebody wants to hold on to you, but they don't love you. Or if they do, they damn sure not loving you, right? you like, I know I deserve better than this. You get what I'm saying? So if this is the best you have to offer me, then you can keep it. Okay, yeah, we got the Hierophant in reverse. You, you see them completely different now. You see them different, all right? So, yeah, we got Judgment card here. So whatever the freak they did, you get what I'm saying? You was like, eh, I'm good on that. And to be honest with you, I feel like... Seven is a magical number. 77 is here, okay? So 77, something about abundance. But I just feel this energy here where whoever I'm talking to, this person, they lied to you so many times about insignificant things, small things, things that really don't matter as to where the overall and bigger picture for you is that they feel comfortable lying. So you're like, I'm good on that. You know, they don't excite you right now. Page of Wands in reverse. And to be honest with you, I'm not sure if they're ever going to do it again. Yeah, we got the Nine of Cups in reverse. For some of you, this person might drink a lot. Okay, so they drink and then they do things when they drink and they use that as an excuse as to why they do the things that they do. And you just feel like you cannot allow for this person to hold you back with a fortune in reverse. You feel like you would rather move forward to the cups and find happiness because you know it's out there for you. And that's true. That is real. That's what I tell you guys all the time. Yes, we would want, right, the twins to come together. But in the event that something like this is going on, which things like this do happen, 
then what are you going to do? You get what I'm saying? Just sit there, be a fool, let the person treat you however, because, oh, that's your twin flame? That sounds crazy as hell. So we have the King of Wands, okay? King of Wands could be fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, but in the event that it's not, doesn't matter. This is somebody who their secrets have just come out, been exposed to you time and time and time again, over and over and over. Um, so with the Judgment card here, once again, you've woken up to the truth that somebody has been trying to manipulate you, deceive you, whatever the case may be. Seven of Wands in reverse, you just don't see it as something that's worth fighting for anymore. Seven of Pentacles in reverse or investing like i said it's something here with that 77 so now you had it four times seven 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 so it's like you realize somebody is like a block for you you get what i'm saying and you don't give a dang you like title no title whatever you is whoever you ain't third party in reverse i'm good you're like i'm good on being a third party i'm good on being a cold ass mashed potatoes i'm good on you thinking you're gonna have steak and then some cold ass mashed potatoes you know i'm good on all of that <laughs> i'm good Okay, so yeah, we got temperance in reverse and we have the queen of pentacles. Okay, so they see you as a wife, a homemaker. You could be earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, but in the event that not, and that's not a placement of yours, doesn't matter. Two of pentacles in reverse is just, you just don't see it as something that is worth the tears, the pain, the heartache. Okay, really nothing is, but yeah, no, just telling you what it is. We got the lover's card here. Poking his head out, page of swords in reverse. I'm also feeling for some of you real shit, this might not even be your, your person. Your person ain't even this person. I feel like your person is about to be putting work in at the same time this other person is fucking up. You get what I'm saying? That's what I'm getting. I told y'all it was going to be new love versus true love. I really feel like that's what's going on. Um, well, <laughs> that's the way the cookie crumbles. I mean, it is what it is. For real, for real, for real. <laughs> it is what it is. We got the Eight of Cups and we have the Will of Fortune. Oh well. You have to. There we go, whatever. You have to do what is best for you. <clears throat> the way I love, I only want to be with somebody that loves me the same way or harder. That's it. You know? So I feel like whoever I'm talking to, you feel the same way. If it's not like that, then. Then why even, right? Why even bother? So let us see, y'all. All right, seven of swords here for feminine. What is this? The hermit in reverse, the star card, and the upright, the king of pentacles. First of all, yeah, this person was definitely not even um, your person. I feel like your person, we have earth sign energy here. Okay, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Doesn't have to be, but here they are. Okay, uh, star card. That's your north node. That's your destiny. Strength card. Yeah, this relationship, like I said, is being worked on. It's being rebuilt. It's being healed while something else is like, you know, you're realizing, okay, this person doesn't actually care the same. They don't love me the same. You're freeing yourself, yeah, from a karmic situation. Double and reverse. See, I know what the hell I be seeing. Two of swords. You might not have wanted to see that, but that's what it is. Okay, so we have the nine of swords here in reverse. Oh, okay. The Queen of Cups, the Devil in Reverse. Yeah, okay, because your heart is not with this karmic anyway. Your heart is somewhere else. Your heart would never be with somebody who's manipulative, deceitful. You get what I'm saying? Do whatever it is to just try to keep you stuck in a situation. Four of Wands in Reverse. There's definitely a separation um, here. Or if you live with this person, you're moving. Okay, they're moving. All right, we have the Page of Wands in Reverse. What is this? The Empress. Yeah, see? The Empress does not get turned on by stuff like this. Are you serious? You get what I'm saying? I'm going to be turned on and you out here fiddling it for... <sighs> you get what I'm saying? Like, that's not attractive to an empress. I'm sorry. Yeah, we got the six of cups in reverse, seven of cups in reverse. You leaving it behind. You don't give a dang. For some of you knew this person since childhood, that means what? You're looking towards your future, not towards your past. Yeah. Six of pentacles, you want reciprocity. You want equally yoked situations. All right, that's it. That is it. All right, we got the Nine of Cups in reverse. What is this? Thank you, Spirit. Okay, we got the Six of Pentacles, the Magician. Yeah, okay. Then to top it off, your divine counterpart is a magician. They're manifesting you back into their life because they too desire reciprocity. They too desire balance. And they feel like you give them that. So Five of Wands here, even if they have to compete for you, that's what they're going to do. Maybe in an energetic way. And I feel like with the High Priestess in reverse, this is the truth being revealed yet again. Okay, so two truths came out during this reading. Okay, let us see. The King of Wands here. What is this? The Knight of Cups. Okay, yeah, so this is the person that you're in a relationship with or, you know, that you were with. I feel like, you know, they might not want to have it in, but it's time for you to let it go. 
four of pentacles in reverse um the hangman is like they try to keep you in the situation but it's like you see it for exactly what it needs to be seen for for period so with the page of cups in reverse all the crying apologizing and this and that in the world is not gonna make a difference we have the three of cups in reverse okay um <clears throat> I know that R. Kelly on his creep shit, but what he said when a woman is fed up, yeah. We got the Three of Cups in reverse, the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. I mean, it's just going to continue to not go anywhere, pretty much. Okay, it's just going to continue to not go anywhere. You know that, so it's just like, it's time to release it. Sorry, nobody wants to go in a, in a repetitive loop. Like I always say for the masculines, you know, so it's really funny because somebody's masculine has something they want to say. This wasn't it. This was what was going on with your karmic, so now I have to see what their masculine wants to say because this wasn't it this was just simply the backstory to what the hell you're going through so let us see what is it that your masculine wants to say thank you spirit messages from the masculine to the feminine messages from the masculine to the feminine thank you okay messages from the masculine to the feminine thank you what are the messages from the ma okay Masculine to the feminine. Please forgive me. I know I messed up. Okay, so in the past they messed up. Like so I said they want to reheal it, reheal it, excuse me. Rebuild it <laughs> or heal it. What the hell reheal it. Maybe you guys have tried in the past, didn't work. Okay. We have I know what you mean to me. I'm ready to be with only you now. Okay, so really interesting how that works, isn't it? Okay. Oh, it says you are so beautiful inside and out. See, so your DM knows what it is okay they know who you are they recognize your soul they're ready to be with you and enjoy this relationship for what it is all i'm thinking about right now is how attracted to you i am because they're constantly drawn back to you they know why they're ready to do whatever needs to be done with that you get what i'm saying so for those of you who are with other people they're ready for you to wrap that shit up at this point you get what i'm saying so that you guys can move forward and proceed yeah see we need to let each other go they want you to let go of whoever that karmic is that you're currently dealing with, you know, so that you guys can come together. See? All right. So our connection is complicated. There are issues out of our control, such as whoever this person is that you're with. But what do I say? What does Blue say? You can go ahead and kick that person to the curb. You get what I'm saying? I know a lot of you are like, it's not that easy. It's not that easy, Blue. Well, listen, take the necessary steps is what I'm saying. There's no one else thinking about you all day. So this person is just waiting on you. Your divine masculine is waiting on you. All right, so I'm always here for you. You see what I'm saying? I'm always here for you. They feel that you're not happy. They're waiting on you to make the decision to do what you need to do. It says, no matter who I am with, my thoughts always lead me back to you. So they're waiting on you. All right, so let me pull some messages here. <clears throat> what does divine feminine need to know, Spirit? Thank you. Love. They love you so much. So, 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 so much. They feel like you need to start seeing your self-worth and understanding what it is that you truly deserve because this relationship or whatever it is that you're a part of right now is not it. And they feel like you really need to go ahead and break up with this person in this karmic pattern of yours. That's why I said it's not always the masculines who are the ones, right? So this masculine wanted to tell you that no, it's actually you. They've been waiting on you. All right, so if this was your reading or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and hugs.